it's critically important, not only in terms of the valuation that you get, but also the time that the deal takes. You know, time is an enemy when you make the decision to sell. Anything can happen in, in, in the interim. Um, it's also going to impact the escrow. The more confidence uh, a buyer has in a company, the lower the escrow amount and the lesser the escrow period will be. So, you know, the way we approach it is, you know, you don't want to be cleaning house under the magnifying glass of a potential buyer. You want to do it when you're not under any pressure. It gives you latitude to, um, to clean things up more effectively. Um, it, it, it reduces the risk that any employees or, or customers or vendors are going to find out that you're going through a transaction. And, you know, many times we'll go into a company because typically they're not running it for when they want to sell it. They're running it to make a, do the best they can now. Um, but, but many, many companies don't have employment agreements in place, especially with salespeople who are going to be key to uh, the post-transaction world and the buyer. Um, intellectual property they may not have, um, you know, have, have all tied up. Um, many times, the, you know, the, the contracts with key customers expired 10 years ago and they've just been doing business ever since. And, you know, that may work day to day, but in the context of a, of a potential new buyer coming in, um, you know, you need that contract in place. So there's many things that a company can do to, uh, to get themselves ready and put themselves in a much better position when you're not under pressure.